Before I start this review, I'd like to say a few things. Lore is a work in progress game, therefore a lot of technical issues will be fixed before the final release. Another thing is, a link to the lore download page will be posted in the description and in the pinned comment, and I really recommend you download this game. Alright, now on to the review. Lore, a stealth action game, is a free to play demo. It is a Hello Neighbor like game, where you have to get red buttons, which are like keys in Hello Neighbor, and you have to get into this dungeon area, like Hello Neighbor's basement. But don't get me wrong, Lore is a unique experience, and I highly recommend it. First, you start in an apartment, where you have to pick up your phone. This whole apartment serves as a tutorial. The tutorial is nicely laid out, and very user friendly. Once you've picked up your phone and listened to the conversation, you leave the apartment and drive to your grandfather's house. Then you enter your grandpa's house only to find that you will be stopped by Laura's main antagonist, which is Uncle Terry. You are then sent to a small room that you have to escape, upon doing which, you will find that Uncle Terry is doing some weird stuff. You are now sent to find four red buttons to escape Uncle Terry by going into the basement. I know this game plus so far kind of sounds a bit oo-woo for you, but trust me, this game is amazing and I recommend it. Well, first of all, I'd like to say, Lore is a very well-made game for a demo. And unlike some demo games, you have an auto-updater for the game, so you don't have to re-download the game every time there's an update. The starting menu is also very nice, and I wouldn't have had it any other way. However, I cannot ignore the frame issues. I was told by the creator that he was currently trying to fix the frame rate, but I had to keep the gameplay footage graphics uh, at low to allow me to record for the gameplay in the background that you guys see. I also had to find out how to use the flashlight myself. Currently you just press F, which is fairly easy to guess. I also wanted more settings, especially brightness. The settings are good for general things like graphics, but I think there should be a sort of advanced settings key, so you can change things like brightness, sound, etc. I found the gameplay to run very well minus minor frame setbacks, and I was told the game could have a few bugs, but I did not encounter any. I also love the current name your price feature, so you can support the creator if you felt like it. The game was also very beautiful. I would gladly just take a screenshot of the forest and make it my wallpaper. Actually, I did this on my laptop. The lighting was uh, beautiful at day, and you could see the effort on the creator's end. However, I felt that at night, the game is extremely dark. This is an easy fix with a brightest uh, setting or slider. The cutscenes were impressive, however. The later cutscenes were harder to follow. Narration would easily fix this. The amazing natural graphics help with the beauty of the cutscenes. The controls are very optimal for the average gamer today. However, I'd like to see um, if an option, uh, if I want to open the doors with the current click and drag system, or just use an activate key like E. Also, please make the door hitboxes bigger. Uh, I found it difficult to open doors when I had to look directly at the handle alone. I'd like maybe a bigger margin of error area, especially when I'm running from Uncle Terry, I had issues trying to open the door. Overall, I had fun playing Lore, a stealth action game. Knowing it is a demo, it does have some work to go. But for its current stage, it is an amazingly good, and I fully recommend you download it from the link below. You can even support the dev for delivering on his game, unlike some huge companies. Keep in mind, this is a one-man show. I hope you guys enjoyed my review of lore. I know this is a different type of video, but I didn't think just gameplay would cut it. Again, I fully encourage you guys to please download this game from the link below. It's an amazing game, and uh, the the creator deserves uh, some credit on this. And yeah, anyway, uh, this was Wool Machine. Have a great day, guys. See ya.